uh, I couldn't wait to do this um, a winter edition one. So the first question is um, a nail polish. So the most worn um, nail polish in winter was um, the OPI Gong Gonzo because I absolutely adore this nail varnish. Um, it's so so nice, so pretty and it just so so reminds me um, like of, like all Christmassy like all the ice and I don't know I just absolutely love this um, I think it's really really pretty and then a Essie Bikini Sotini I absolutely adore this blue colour and it also um, has a shimmer of like silver silver running through it um, which is really really nice um, really gorgeous colour and the last nail polish is um, the Beyond Cozy this is absolutely amazing um, I've shown you this before I absolutely love this colour it is so gorgeous and sparkly and oh it's lovely it's got like little tiny tiny bits of glitter in it it's really really pretty I love it second question is hair product um, which has to be I've left it up there excuse me it has to be the L'Oreal Aviv Extraordinarily Extraordinary Oil um, which is this here um, this has done wonders for my hair I absolutely um, love this oil. It smells gorgeous and it's weightless. I love it. Been so good in the winter. Next question: um, most worn scent that would that was um, Naughty Alice. I've only got a little tiny bit left. So it was Naughty Alice. I absolutely adore this perfume for summer and winter. Um, but then at Christmas I got the Lady Gaga perfume. What was this called? I can't remember what it's called. Is it Fame? Lady Gaga Fame? I'm sure it is. Um, like I said, <laughs> been using it ever since Christmas. <laughs> it's already down there. This, if you haven't tried this, this is a gorgeous scent. And I know everybody goes on about this on YouTube, but I totally agree. It is such, such a gorgeous scent. I can't do without this now. It's absolutely gorgeous. Question four. Most worn bag. That has to be this one. This <coughs> bag here um, with the skulls on which I got for Christmas. Um, I absolutely um, adore this bag. It's so, so pretty. Um, I absolutely adore it. This has been everywhere with me. Um, I cannot get enough for this bag. Next question. Most worn shoes well that's got to be my boots um these ones i got here which were from new look and they've got skulls on them i absolutely adore these and the other set of boots is these ones here um which it's like got a platform there as you can see um it's got a little buckle um it does all the way up and they come over the knee um, so yeah, been loving those also. Next question, um, most worn accessory. This bracelet, um, this is so, so pretty. I cannot stop wearing this bracelet. It's got a little angel on it. And then this skull, um, necklace which I absolutely adore and also my cross necklace um, or sidewards cross necklace um, it looks like that 
and then earrings I've been loving wearing these I absolutely adore these earrings um, these ones here they've got crosses on them then they've got like a little stone and then they've got a spike um, so yeah they've got two crosses as I said a bead and a spiky bit I absolutely love those and then my two bracelets, which I got from New Look ages ago. Um, these ones have um, skulls in, which you know I'm a fan of. Um, yeah, I just love them. I like friendship bracelet. I can't speak today. Friendship bracelet type um, bracelets. So I've been loving them. And also scarves. Now I didn't used to wear scarves at all. Um, Kerry from Kerry Loves Glam um, got me into scarves. Um, I never used to wear them at all. I didn't even like them at one point, but now I cannot get enough of scarves. So, I've been wearing mostly every single kind of those. Every day I tend to swap and change. Um, so I've got a gorgeous skull and a cross one, which is here, which is so, so pretty and it's got like um, the edges are like that like torn edges I love the colors in this um, the purple and the pink in the crosses I absolutely adore that one then I got this one that Kerry from Kerry Loves Glam and um, brought me from Chris for Christmas um, which I absolutely love the skulls on this are amazing it's got a little cross on his head and um, it's got heart eyes and it's in pink and white and I absolutely love this one. Next is this one here, another skull one, and this one has got um, this is quite a big one also. Um, it's got flowers and skulls. If you can see, it's got like flowers coming out the skulls. Um, again, love that one. And then two more to go. Um, this one's just a black one. Um, it's got like pretty patterns running down the side and then if I fold it in half um, it's got loads of white skulls on it um, I just think that was so so pretty and that isn't a very big one um, but I absolutely um, love that one and then this one which oh, if I turn it around is a snood one as you know, snood, it's all in one. Um, this has got gorgeous skulls on with a heart nose. Um, it's got like brown in it, it's grey. Um, really, really pretty. I love this one. So that's all my scarves that I've been um, wearing. And then question eight, no, question seven. Um, most worn um, clothing um, that has got to be um, my like shiny leggings um, I think I got them from a Primark um, they are very very comfortable and um, they don't slip down um, usually when I get shiny leggings um, by the time I've walked to one side of the room to the other they usually fell down um, but these ones, um, they do not fall down at all. Um, I think they was £8 um, from Primark and I really, really love them. The next thing is my owl jumper. I've been <laughs> loving wearing my owl jumper. It is so, so warm. And I just think the owl on it is so, so cute. So I haven't been able to stop wearing that. And then just a normal um, green, like short-sleeved, um, thin jumper um, which is longer at the back um, than at the front I absolutely love wearing that it's so nice and I love it and um, the next thing is my leather jacket um, I got this one from Primark and I haven't stopped wearing it it's nice and warm and I love the detail on it detailing on it I just think it's amazing um, the next thing is foundation well BB cream for me and it has to be the number seven beautiful skin 
um, BB cream. You've all seen this before because I go on about it all the time. Um, but yeah, that's my go-to um, BB cream. Question nine, blusher and bronzer. Blusher wise, I've been using this a lot. Um, love this. Um, it's the Havana, Benefit Havana. Um, I love this blush. It's so, so pretty. And the smell of this brush is bl brush. The smell of this blush is out of this world. It is gorgeous. And it's such a gorgeous, gorgeous colour. I absolutely love it. And like I said, it smells delicious. Um, bronzer. That has to be the Bronze Perfection um, by MUA. I've um, been using it that much and my lid has broke. Um, and I have also hit pan. Um, I reckon this is a fantastic quality um, bronzer. If you haven't checked out this bronzer, I really suggest um, you try it out because I think it's great. It doesn't make you look orange. I got it on. No, I haven't got it on today. Sorry. Um, <laughs> it doesn't make you look orange. It just gives you like a natural, like bronzy glow, and I absolutely love that. So that's the MUA and um, Bronze Perfection. Question 10, lip products. Um, I've got three. The first thing is my Balmy. Um, this is my coconut one, um, which I've still got loads left. I absolutely love this one. I have got two more, um, but I just love this one. The coconut Balmy. And then the next thing is my 17 Mirror Shine lipstick in Beehive. Um, which you've all seen before. Um, this is just so so moisturising for me. Um, it's just a nude colour and I absolutely love it. And then from the Revlon Just But Inkissable Lip um, Balm Stains. This is in Cherish and it's um, again so moisturising. Um, it's got the minty taste um, which I'm not too keen on. Um, and the minty smell, um, which I'm not too keen on, um, but I absolutely love this colour. And again, it's so, so moisturising. I have to have moisturising things for my lips. Um, so these three things have been brilliant over the winter. Next question, mascara. Mascara is the Rimmel Extra Wow Lash. Um, it's a lash building mascara, um, which looks like that. Um, this is really really nice. It's got a gorgeous a Gorgeous brush as you can see there um, This doesn't clump I've just been really really loving that in the winter um, The only reason why I've um, been using this one in the winter is because I'm trying to use up um, What I've got before I open any more which I've got quite a few to open um, but yeah, the Rimmel Extra Wow Lash, um, really, really been enjoying using that in the winter. Next one, question 12, the last one is eyeshadows. Now, um, I've been using a lot of the Urban Decay um, Naked 2, um, just because I know the colours I like in here and if I'm in a rush, I know which colours to put on quickly and so forth. Um, so it's been the Naked 2. And the colours I tend to go for are um, Booty Call, um, YDK and Busted. Um, so those are the colours there. And then the second palette, which I've been really, really loving. I didn't think I would like it, um, but I really, really do love this. It's the NYC Individual Eyes. Excuse the, the um, so called the creamy ones at the bottom because they are filthy because all the eyeshadows have gone into them. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, this one is for um, created for blue eyes. As you know, I haven't got blue eyes. I've got green eyes. Um, but these colours are absolutely amazing. I love them. Um, so I look like this. Again, sorry um, for the bottom bits. I don't know why. It's a bit silly they put them in there really because they are cream. 
and when you go to get your eyeshadows it all falls into there so it's a good job I don't use these two really um, but those colours on there are absolutely amazing I I love every single colour and this colour here I think is stunning um, it's a really really gorgeous colour I absolutely love it um, so those are the two palettes the Naked 2 and the NYC individual um, eyes and the blue eye one um, so that is the tag I hope um, you all enjoyed. I hope this video wasn't too dark for you. Um, I'm having problems with the sun again. Um, I preferred it when it was snowing and, you, and the sun wasn't coming out. Um, you could see me more clearly. Um, but yeah, I'm sorry if this has been really, really dark. I'm going to say a big thank you to all my new subscribers. Um, I've had quite a few over the past weeks. Um, and I just want to see, say a big massive thank you. Um, it really, really does mean a lot to me um because it comes through on my phone and i get all excited but i know somebody has subscribed to me um so a big huge thank you to you and a big huge thank you to all my old subscribers and again to all my old subscribers keep leaving your um, comments down below because I love hearing from you and hearing um, what you've got to say and also any new subscribers please please just leave a comment um, I do um, reply well try to reply um, to every single one um, that um, comments on my videos so please leave a comment um, yeah and I will see you in my next video take care bye bye